What's up, Jones Bones? It is your girl, United Leave Random. And today, we're going places. Or at least one place. So, um, I have a new coworker, and I have another coworker that's kind of like a boss coworker that offered to take us to Sam's or Ikea. So, we're either going to Sam's or Ikea. I want you to uh, pause and guess where we're going down below in the comments. And uh, I will show you around when I get there. It was at this moment that he knew. He fucked up. So, here we are, here we are, and let me tell you, Ikea is so much cheaper in another country. Like, I'm looking at everything and I'm like, like, if we look at this, if we look at this, how much is this whole thing? This whole thing. $7.99. What is that in USD? That's what I'm trying to compute because honestly, a lot of the things are not what they would cost in USD. Um, it's very busy right now, so I can't really show you around, but like, there's, like, honestly, if Ikea was as cheap as it is here in America, I would always be an Ikea girly. And like, it just makes me want to redecorate. I think that's the, the love of Ikea. You just go there and you just want to do something different, something new. But yeah, I'm in Ikea and I'm enjoying it. I'm trying to make sure that I don't get anybody in like the background or anything, you know, I'm getting the usual being stared at foreigner, but like also like, you know, I am recording inside of a Ikea right now. <laughs> My future kitchen, you know. And we got a two for one. Guess where I am? And if you didn't see, I'm also at Sam's. And so I'm taking everything in, trying to figure out what I should get. And I immediately saw some porch. And I was like, I want to be more healthy. And someone told me, hey, Aaliyah, maybe you should eat porridge in the morning. So there's two different porridges called bird's nest porridge. Um, I don't understand what it means by dried bird's nest, though. That does not sound delicious. But it is porridge, so... <laughs> What's up, Jones Bones? It is your girl, you're Natalie Random, and I just arrived home, and I wanted to show you what I got while I was at the store. So I got some tropical, I got these. I got some tropical popsicles. You know, I'm a popsicle girl. I'm not really into that creamy type stuff. Um, I told you guys about the bird's nest porch. The bird's nest porch. Well, I got some of the bird's nest porch and the bird's nest porch also came with oat and coconut milk. So I suppose it's just like, I'm trying to get out of the way, but it's just like a yummy, delicious grain thing that you would have in the morning. So I'm gonna stack them up so that I can actually eat them, you know what I mean? Um, get them in my tummy and then get them out of my tummy and just, you know, be chill. Be chill, I have food in my home. Like, I find myself like, it really feels like I'm like getting ready for like something bad to happen. I have two things of noodles, six things of porridge now. I have uh, rice, I have four things of ravioli. I have this granola mix that I showed you like a month ago and I've never opened it. Um, You know, that is me. That is me. Now, also, I bought some pistachio bars, okay? So let me show you the pistachio bars. So I, got, I bought a thing of pistachio bars. Yeah, I bought a thing of pistachio bars. And I'm looking into the, the camera to see if you guys can see it, but I bought a thing of pistachio bars. And then past that point, Pistachio bars, popsicles, I got this. This is like the only thing that I can't eat. It's a pen. Honestly, it's a like quill pen. Um, my students have had one and I've been kind of looking at them use their quill pens and it's made me want to have a quill pen. 
But yeah, it's a quill pen. So, yeah, I got a quill pen. So I thought that was nice, okay? Like, judge me if you will, but that's nice. So I'm gonna start writing with my quill pen. And, you know, I've always kind of wanted a quill pen. I've had one for art before. Um, my teacher made us buy one to use in our art class. And it was kind of a mess. It was a communal quill pen, and I very easily broke the tip, okay? But this time, this time, this is not a communal quill pen. This is a fancy quill pen. So hopefully I don't break it. But yeah, that's what I got today. And I went to Ikea and I went to Sam's. And I can definitely say that the country that I am in right now, like, wow, I, wow. Money from the U.S. would go a long way here. Ikea's cheaper. Sam's is cheaper. Like, it's a lot of money if you look at it, like, just from where I am. But compared to where I've come from, baby, I'm, what, what? It's amazing. So, that was a little bit of what I did today. Didn't really do much. I worked today too, so you know, I'm working hard for you guys, creating content, you know what I mean? Um, <laughs> but all in all, that's a little taste of life overseas. And I hope that you've enjoyed it. Let me know if there's any other things that you want me to talk about, um, because I, I'm pretty open. I, I think if I can muster up the, the energy and the courage to record in public, you know, Oh my gosh, we can make it happen. <laughs> y'all, y'all like, y'all like, what just happened? Let me show you. I, I, I don't be in my kitchen. You know, I mean, I'm never in my kitchen. However, I was in my kitchen, and um, I noticed that, and I was like, oh no, it's a roach. And then I looked, and I'm like, oh, it's not. But then I looked here, and I was like, oh. You know what I mean? I was like, oh. That's kind of yucky. Would I lick it for $100? Maybe not $100. You got to give me a little bit more money than that. But yeah. Also, I haven't been updating um, you guys, but I'm growing a plant. Okay, I'm growing a plant. It's a sunflower. And um, you see this? It's struggling. It is struggling right now. But yeah, I'm growing a plant. So... Be proud of me. Anyway, bye-bye. Much love and positive vibes.